Castellanos started after it tried to hold up now look to first got him Ricky Holiday with the call man at first so digging in now for Philadelphia JT Real Muto that one ripped but foul Oh, one down. Foul ball there. And the 2 Good job to fight that one off. Schwarber leads off first with one away. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. New pitcher for the Marlins, Steven Oker. Bringing in the lefty with the left-handed hitter coming up to hit. Classic bullpen move right here, so we'll see how it works out. Stop. In the box with two gone, and it takes a look at a called strike. That smash towards center. Squeezes it, and that ends the inning. Now into the ball game on defense, Edmundo Sosa. He's the new third baseman. So they turn to Craig Kimbrell. Well, he's the guy they hope to turn to out of the pen to lock down wins. So this game has gone to plan, more or less. Let's see if he can wrap it up here. And a pitch. Bell leading things off and takes a strike. Fought off foul. Right hander kicks deals. One and ball. there's a ball. That one misses. Now two and two. Riding to the play. And it's filled up. In the air, left field. Schwarber pulls it in on the run. Next to hit, Jazz Chisholm Jr. We talk about guys with good speed, and definitely he has it. But pushing the offense aside for just a second, Chris, it's the defensive side that I think the speed factors in the most. At the belt and fires. Good eye right there. Well, he gets to balls that get by most people at that position. Just really impressive because there are certain times the ball comes off the bat, automatically that team that hit it thinks that they've got a base hit or they may have extra bases, and he just takes it away. The two on. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. And what makes him even quicker is the fact that he's so dialed in on the pitch as it's moving through the hitting zone. He can see how that hitter's lined up, what he's trying to do, and where that pitch is going to end up, which gives him that really quick first step. And that's why he makes so many great plays. Long run, nice grab. And there's two down. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. And first offering is fouled off. Swing and a miss. 0-2. Oh, well, so many hard-throwing relievers in the game these days, you would think that guys have made the adjustment, but I don't know if you ever get used to it. Just pump and gap. Down. And that'll do it. So the Philadelphia Phillies off of the right foot here in this wild card series. They take game one.